Today, I'm going to demonstrate a more transformative perspective on how to engage the body in rabbit pose so that you truly improve the health of your spine without weakening the fabric of the discs. This transformative approach will not only improve your spinal health, but you'll also tone and strengthen the abdominal muscles, eliminating body tension and developing a more informed awareness. The truth is, the conventional approach towards rabbit pose of squeezing inwards down regulates spinal communication and overly compresses the discs, causing disc delamination, which is the precursor to disc herniation, better known as slip disc. In order to improve spine health, you need to awaken the brain's communication with the deep core spinal muscles, not turn them off. These deep core spinal muscles form the foundation of a healthy spine. They underpin all unrestricted, powerful, pain-free movements in life, maintaining stability and ensuring the discs are never overly compressed when skipping walking or playing with your dog in the park. I will now guide you through an alternative expansive approach to rabbit pose that strengthens the brain's connection with the spinal muscles. Your goal is no longer one of rounding, compressing inwards, but one of expanding outwards while eliminating body tension. It does require more effort, but delivers outstanding long-term benefits. Notice the dynamic use of breath. Step one, first you prime the body. Kneel down, feet together, sitting upright. Exhale, arms up while expanding the chest open. Quick inhale, exhale, drive, chest up away from the hips, lengthening the spine. Back muscles relaxed, bum off the heels, arms down, chin in. Inhale, maintain this primed structure. Step two, exhale, relaxing the back muscles, expand out the chest, driving chest up away from the hips as you round down, all on one expansive exhale. Once down, inhale, loosely grab the feet while maintaining this expansive position. Step three, exhale, roll forward while expanding the chest open like a flower. Now, simply maintain this expansive structure while releasing all surface tension. Your power is in the exhale. Relax and open is your mantra. When coming out, you exhale, expanding out the chest, keeping the bum off the heels. Try it. Give it a go. Feel how powerful and in control the body feels. How close you're able to get your forehead to the knee is totally irrelevant. What's far more important is the muscular engagement of the spine while keeping all the surface superficial back muscles relaxed. If your surface back muscles are not fully relaxed, your inner spinal muscles will be unable to maintain an open spine without any negative overcompression. Relaxing the back muscles is an active process, not a passive one. The more you target your effort on eliminating tension, the more expansive power you will feel. Today, my approach to yoga is polar opposite to that of 20 years ago. My focus is no longer on body positioning, but on body engagement. The results are outstanding. I have witnessed an 82-year-old with significant mobility issues and a young aspiring boxer with chronic lower back pain experienced profound rapid improvements. It works. It works for everybody. Rewinding back the years without injury. Practice this approach and share your experience in the comments. Please explore my website where you'll find a treasure trove of tutorials, classes and other valuable stuff to assist you in pushing the boundaries of what is truly possible. Don't forget to like and subscribe to get that algorithm working so that others can benefit from this more transformative body engagement approach to yoga.